Hello friends, welcome back to the garden. It is January 1st, 2023, and we're pulling weeds. One thing I wanted to show you today was another important strategy that many plants around here use. So previously we talked about how plants climb, but another plant strategy is cover. So it can be hard to know what that means, but there are plants that will just cover an area and if they outgrow the thing that you want, then you have to come and rescue and dig out your stuff from the plants that have covered it. So here, this looks like just like this stuff, right? Like this little stuff. But I'm going to reach in there and pull out. And you're going to see something shocking up here. I will make a, a pineapple plant up here. And I didn't make it appear. It was actually in there all along. It was just completely covered. And the space under here, look at how much space there is under here. Not a lot of soil, but there is a large space where everything is kind of growing and tangled. So this is one area that's covered and I'm uncovering the plants. That's part of the, what the weeding is that we do. Here's another great covered area covered. You wouldn't know what this was, but I can tell you from where I'm standing to here, it's like over a foot. And in here, you can actually dig, 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 dig. And there's about a foot more of coverage of this plant that grows all over everything. So that's one of the reasons why when you plant things, you should know how quickly something that you're planting is going to spread and what its growth strategy is, right? And what kind of problems you're going to have in your garden. So if you have plants that really will just like cover everything, then the task that you have at hand is the kind of daily maintenance is to dig out everything that is uh, getting covered, right? Here's another area getting covered. covered. This is passion fruit lilikoi. There's a beautiful flower. Passion fruit lilikoi, really great for covering stuff. It looks likes to climb and cover. This whole area is like covered and under here you can pretty much go and there's like a little space under here where the passion fruits fall. And there's a pineapple. I went through here before and kind of uncovered some stuff. Here's a little banana that's getting covered. Now some plants like to be covered, especially when they're younger. Under here, it's a kind of a safe environment for small plants because these plants take the bright heat of the sun, they take the powerful rain, and then down in there, it's a more steady environment. It's kind of shaded. You're not going to get too much sun and it's not going to dry out as much as like up here um, when it goes from wet to dry. So it's a bit of a protect protective environment and some plants, especially when they're young, really love that. But other plants just can't grow fast enough. So here's a very small tea plant. I can unbury it. This is just an ornamental plant tea cutting. And we just kind of had to unbury it and give it some room so that it can actually get the sun that it needs. And so there are plants that have, you know, all these plants have different strategies. Um, this plant, this is the Gynura bicolor, they climb and then they hang down, right? But they can also cover. They're covering an area right here. So that's just another strategy that plants use to get ahead covering just straight up crawling and spreading out. They fill in a rectangular area because some plants, they go kind of like straight. They just snake along. This guy, this is a weed. This is called Vidalia. I have a whole other video about this that I can link to. This stuff can both crawl like a vine and it'll also cover. So depending on, you know, where, where it is, it'll do... It'll try both. It'll try all strategies, both covering and snaking through. 
so you gotta be aware what you're planting, how your plants grow. They've all got their different strategies. They're all trying to reach for the sun and maximize their plantiness. Okay, I'll be back later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hey folks, just wanted to share another quick example of you of the covering mode of plants. So this is like, how many pallets deep is this? This is at least two pallets. And these are the Vidalia that are growing over it. There are pallets under here. Um, let me drop these. I'll show you. I even didn't know that there were pallets under here. Just stacked for later use because it was so covered. But yeah, this is what covering looks like. This is the covering strategy. And Vidalia is a wonderful winner at this strategy. All right, talk later. Bye-bye.